Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to the channel. Today, right, uh, quickly, tragic incident. My tripod got crushed because we've got these like, we've got these plug things that you like plug the bike into the wall. I've got, got one here, you can see, so you like slot the tire in. And I had my tripod set down over there behind like all the other bikes. And my sister got her bike out and they all fell down on it. So now my tripod's crushed. So now you're on, uh, you're on my shelf um, on top of a cupboard. So. Yeah, epic start. But I, uh, I think it was a year ago, next month, I attempted to put. Where are they? That's rubbish. Anyway, I put B twin forks. Is that them? Oh, they're behind there. No, I'm not going to get them out. Anyway, B twin forks. Put B twin forks on my BMX. Um, I'll put like a screenshot of the video here. So I did that, and. I had a busted hip at the, at the time because I tried skateboarding and I like tried an ollie and then like yeah so today I've been fixing up my BMX um, because it's it's like an entry level harrow so uh, yeah I've had a new headset for it because the other one, other one got wrecked I've uh, taken apart the wheel and like put all the bearings back in so given it full service down the bottom bracket so that's all good only issue I have had is with the chain um, being slightly loose but you know it should be all right there's like dirt and grime in there and it's it's a bit concerning sometimes the seat was also like rusted in place so i had to get that out with a new tool um so yeah basically this chain is like it's it's not gonna it never does focus but it is it looks a bit loose so uh that's gonna be a bit of an issue i might have to take some spare chain with me um <clears throat> but I'm just going to fix this up quickly, and once we're all done, we can go for a ride. Let's go. Okay, so, oh, the lighting's off. That went a lot quicker than I expected. Um, there we go, it's all done. Um, obviously, because I had no idea how to maintain a bike back when I got this, uh, these dropouts, because I used to just like go ham on tightening these nuts, so this dropout on this side is a little bit wider than it should be, so there's a little gap. Hopefully it should hold. Um, I'm going to take some spanners with me. And um, the chain tension's all right. It's just a bit loose. So uh, that's going to be a slight problem. Now we've just got to pump up the tyres. I've got the original grips. They were flanged, but now I've cut the flange, flanges off. Well, I did that a long time ago. We've got a tiny bit of head rock, but I should, I'm should. i going to try and tighten that when I get off the stand now. And then, uh, yeah, I'll go for a ride. Okay, so we've fixed the BMX. Um, obviously, as you can see, working fine. I pumped up the tyres, adjusted everything. The compression, I keep getting a bit of head rock, but then I just have to tighten up that top cap and it does it fine. Got my bag, got some lunch, some drinks, some cameras and gear and tools and stuff, so it's pretty heavy. But we're going to go and session skate park up the road, Crookham Skate Park. Then we're going to go over to Fleet Skate Park for a bit and then maybe go Edenbrook. All the jumps are for a bit, so we can get some nice runs uh, practice for tomorrow, which I'm going to 4A with Dan, which is like really cool little jump park in the woods. And I thought I'd do my BMX, that's why I've rebuilt it. So I've fixed it because obviously going to some new dirt jumps, I want to learn some gap jumps. So if I can do those and if I have to bail, then obviously I'm on a BMX and it'll be much easier. So let's just go. Okay, so I should probably say before I start, um, haven't ridden a BMX in over a year, so this is going to be proper shockingly bad. Um, I also haven't, um, well, I'm currently recording on my GoPro Hero 5, see that, um, Hero 5 Black, so it's going to be pretty shockingly bad audio and probably video as well. But you know, we'll see how it goes. So let's get to the skate park. Okay, so not too far to the skate park. Um, haven't ridden this in ages, so I might be a bit rusty, but let's give it a go. Brakeless as well. Oh, dropping in. Funny heart. Oh. Oh. Not too bad, everything's holding up. That was a dodgy first run. I'm gonna hit the pump track. Dropping in. Some speed. Oh, this is getting 
sketchy. Alright, wasn't too bad. It's getting the hang of it, I think. Let's give it another run. I've almost got that actually. Almost got fakey. 180 fakey. It's really windy though. sure how this is going to go but just prepare yourself for a steezy ass one footer also we've got a grass bank off to the left that's like behind the quarter pipe so we've only got maybe like three feet of space on top of the quarter pipe so we'll give it a go see how it goes there isn't much space at all that i got that kicked out well far i'll try again from another angle Just couldn't pull it. Try again. Almost, I feel like that was it. I've got the least the least grippy shoes with the least grippy pedals, so it is what it is, but that, that worked, I think. I'm gonna try that knack knack again. Um, I feel like I can get it. Just it's taking time because my shoes aren't grippy, but we'll see. One and uh, see if I can do a bit more. Brakes. There we go. One hand. There we go. That was nice. Pad rock is. Mad. Good run.